Hi everyone and welcome to Power Plays. I'm Harry and today we're going to be getting that third star on sweaty palms in Two Point Hospital. So we need to cure 200 patients, cure rate of 90%, hospital value of 5 million, thermal comfort of 90%. So thermal comfort, that'll be fine. Uh, worst comes to worst, we'll just buy a load more aircon um, or hopefully our janitors will keep on top of maintaining our current aircons. Our cure 200 patients, that's just going to happen naturally. Whether this pushes it to a, a, a um, two-part video or not, we will see. Cure is going to be a bit harder. We need to make sure we're building all the rooms possible so we're not sending patients home and we're training people up. And then hustle value. That's probably going to be the hardest bit about this. We need to make sure that um, we're making lots of money, that we've got a healthy cash bank balance, and yeah, and a lot of physical assets, but we will we will get there. So, I mean, let's oh yeah, that's being that's being repaired now. So let, let's have a look. So we can see that our cash value, our cash balance is helping things out with our hospital value. Our profit, it's all right. It's not great. Uh, so we need to find a way of bumping that up. And essentially, we're going to do that by getting more patients through the door. Yeah, that's not going to happen when we're not checking them in, guys. There we go. So, we're going to get our training done. We're going to make sure we're building all the rooms possible. So, I'm going to take this building just because it's, it's a similar shape to that, as you can see. And you can see this is a nice shape. Uh, building so I'm actually probably gonna move the surgery and just stick it in here then what we can do is we can have a, like another little treatment area in that building as well we got all our machines upgraded as much as possible Decent amount of staff. Let's have a look. We got anyone else we want to hire? Surgery. Yeah, you can see our um, hospital value is doing pretty good. And look, we got already got that built. So let's just kit it out with some aircon because it is red like fire everywhere. Just yeah. Would not like to be in that building. And then let's just sprinkle some fire extinguishers around. And as always, as we kind of build rooms, we are going to end up selling some of these. So I'm not too fussed about it, but do want to make sure that we're getting them in because we don't want the hospital to, to just be go on fire, especially with these emergencies that we've got. Uh, emergencies, natural disasters. Sorry. So. Let's start it off with this here. I'm gonna, no, that's not what I'm gonna do. Drop you in there. Let's drop you in there. So you two are working fine. This training course is gonna be done just now. So let's have a look at what the next training is gonna be. Doctors, we could get a, another GP. We could get a treatment done couple of them could do with, well we got two that could do with treatment. Do you know what, let's, let's get the assistant trained, they're not going to get promoted unless I train them. Uh, no, reset, reset, there we go. And do you know what, for us to do a fracture ward, we're, we're going to need to actually have some more ward nurses. At the moment, we've survived all this time with just two ward nurses. That's how much the ward is used. It isn't. I think it's one of the first rooms I built as well. Let's treat them anyway. Hopefully we'll start to avoid that sort of stuff. Um, with our training of the GPs. You see the staff when they're walking through here, you can see they just have to slow down just to do this corner a bit. It's, it's not ideal, 
um, I'd move it. So what? If, are they going to come through? Yeah. So you can see they just have to slow down just a bit there. As I said, it's not ideal, but um, we'll deal with it for now. I'll put up with it for now. I could... I could just move it. I could just go like this. There we go. And move it to my new treatment area. There we go. Someone dying from surgery. That doesn't surprise me at all. And there we go. Now it's fine. No one has to slow down. That means that our training's done. You can actually see they've just been promoted again. So I'm just going to get that third customer service training done. Hopefully this will be quick because we're not going to be able to check people in in the meantime. Which again is going to have a knock on because we're not going to earn as much money. We're not going to cure as many people. So it's going to knock on everything. So hopefully we'll just get this done quickly. Let's go another treatment nurse in. No, this one. There we go. That wasn't good for our hospital value at all. I say, I felt the effects of that earthquake all the way over no. here. Deframed there on retort, I was awarded for my many accomplishments, but he nearly fell on my head. This I have to do some I'm going to keep them just so just for now. I keep on saying I'm going to get rid of them. I'm going to keep them just for now because I will then um, get them just to train that treatment too. So let's just pick them up. <laughs> Drop them there. Because we've got a bit of a cue there. Um, Alright, I said treatment too. So yeah, we got a few people in need treatment too. Oh, we've got one person here. I swear we needed a few. Yeah, hospital value took a big hit there. We were at... Um, 2.5 so you can see yeah not good we all survived that unscathed yeah I think we're all good you just need to constantly be checking these out because the last thing you want is the last thing you want is for the machine to explode that really wouldn't be good Let's let's just start getting a few more, picking up just a few more nurses where I can. Let's pick up another janitor as well. There we go. This one that I just want to be there. Training course completed. There we go. One, two, three, four there. All right, so sorry. Training course completed. I've got two nurses. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, yeah, six treatment nurses for the one, two, three, rooms yeah that'll do for now what we can now do is get these nurses trained in ward management because as you've seen we have had a bit of demand for a fracture ward so we definitely need some more nurse. and to be honest what we're gonna have four nurses then working in the ward and we're only gonna have four nurses so it would be nice to have a fifth and I'm not going to say no to a, another treatment nurse. It saves me a job. Just need to be careful. Not hiring too many, because then we just have like the expenses just sitting around. There you go, chromotherapy, so that's the nurse that's going to work in there. So I feel justified getting the um, extra treatment nurse. <laughs> 
So let's get a fracture clinic on the go. So slightly bigger room. And let's just do the traction beds first. So we can do one here, one there. I'm gonna do the four corners room essentially. I can then stick a, there we go, a nurse's desk just there. And then the plaster caster essentially just here bit of a tight squeeze yeah it is it is a bit of a tight squeeze let's just make it one one bigger just for that extra space there you go i can now push this here and push this against here perfect remember the plaster cast is also a machine so just be careful for that and i'm just gonna put the Put two aircon units in just to cover the ground and we can fit medicine cabinets in between here i promise you can it's just not going to be reachable i think because of that um aircon unit i think the aircon unit's blocking it there we go there we go yeah the aircon unit's blocking it what I can do is just pick it up, stick it here, and that should now service the whole room instead. Ooh. So now you can, yeah, now you're gonna let me place it. Perfect. All about those medicine cabinets. There we go. Yeah. Oh, let's get the nearly forgot, but let's get the gold stars down. And to be a bit careful with the placement here, just because you can't put them that close to the traction bed. So you can just, just put them behind the medicine cabinets and then they'll still, the patient lying in the bed will still get the bonus. And there we go. Now we can just jot a few more around. Perfect. So now we've got a fracture ward. I'm pretty sure I've set them already. Yep, they can already work there. And Training these ones, there we go. You guys can already work in there as well. Perfect. Oh, they're tempting me with staff. So let's have a look. Let's have a look at what we've got. I think we're really going to benefit from sorting out our treatment staff. I want to make sure we focus on that for now. We're not making... Didn't make money that quarter, but yeah, I'm, I'm not going to worry too much about it. just want to focus on getting this done. Getting those trainings in. It's going to help us pick up that cure rate. It's then going to help us make money. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna worry too much about stuff right now. I am gonna build though a chromotherapy. That'll fit just nicely here. Let's stick this just in the corner here. We'll get the console in that corner. We can get an aircon unit just here. Let's get a fire extinguisher down. And let's get some gold stars in. Again, that's just going to stop us from having to send patients home. I knew we'd turn things around. Janitor, to repair drug mixer. Bye. There we go. Let's get this upgraded. Get you there, and I forgot I can just set this to accept an extra staff member. They're really tempting me to hire more staff. 
What I do need to do though is I do need to train these guys because they've been waiting for a long time. So let's get that done. Let me have a let's have a look at how the queues are doing. I mean no wonder the queues aren't that bad because no one's checking patients in. We got three GP officers. There's a chance we could need another. One, two, three, four, five. Five GP officers. Five GPs, four rooms. Mm. Could make it work. No, oh, they've gone anyway. Ah oh, well, we'll we'll put up with it for now. Let's get these lot trained. You actually, yeah. Uh... Ooh. How's this going? It's going a bit slowly. Looks like we're going to need to build a DNA lab at some point soon. We're close to award season. Oh, we can get this upgraded as well. Get you in there. Let's DNA lab. It's only a small one, so that'll fit nicely just there. I'm not gonna, because um, I know I haven't got the right staff for it yet, so I'm not going to have it open, but I will, um, I will build it and I'll just essentially close the room. So for now, it'll be, so it'll be ready. We'll be able to upgrade the machines, but we just need to wait until we get some treatment doctors that we can train in um, uh, in the DNA genetics trait. So I would love that doctor that had no skills. Yes, well, my, both my nurses are training. They'll get there. Six. That's that's all we can. That's the, I mean that's the best we can do. So we'll take that all day long. So we've got one of them's learnt now. That ward management. You see, both of them are actually ready to learn the next one. So while the nurse is there, I'm just going to get them to do that. I can drop the other one in once it's done. And what we have got the abdominal. Really don't like these epidemics. Let's see if we can get this done fairly quickly. Get it out of the way with. Huh, resolution has it. Any of these have it? No. Yes, you have it. And you're there for the fracture ward clinic thing. Anyone else around here? Can't see anyone. Still can't see anyone. A few sad faces though. Ah, so it it's sp it's spread. So somewhere where there's a queue. Wonder if it's any of you guys. We'll only be able to tell once you move, really. So it's hopefully this person coming out. We should be able to see. No, none of them have it. Hmm. At least we're making some money again. Ward management training's done. So I'm actually just going to grab this one now and get them trained in it. I know I'm spending a decent amount of money for a trainer, but I'm fine with that. We don't have that many ward nurses, so we need it. Oh, it's starting to grow. Starting to spread. I can't see them though. Roachburger's first drive-through has opened in Crockle Bay. Now you can order your Roach extra burger. crunchy burgers without leaving the comfort Ooh. of your car. And remember, 
Yes. Stop shaking. Roach Roach Burgers. Let's get you in there. Where are these people? Where are these infected people? I mean, we need everything fixed, so... Yeah. We've got three people infected. It's probably about to go up. Alright, let's see what... What training we can do. Then we eventually need to find these three. Nurse to the ward, please. I literally have not seen them anywhere. Let's just get rid of all these notifications. What? Am I just missing something? I mean, I know you've got it. You're a mummy. Any of you two? No. I'm just gonna have to start testing some of these actual mummies out. None of these lot have it. No one around here has it. This guy has it. There we go. He's rage quit. Whoopsie. Let's get you fixing that. Need that fixing as well. Need everything fixing. Hmm. It's going to annoy me this soon. Because I haven't seen them at all. <laughs> there we go. Usually when I start to not be able to see them, I wonder if it's my assistants. Because they're sat down the whole time, so you just never see them get up and move. And it's probably someone leaving the hospital that I'm just missing. Um, I said I wanted... Why did I want... Oh, there we go. Why did I want... Oh, I wanted a DNA. There we go. Oh, perfect. So let's hopefully just get this going really quickly. Come on, 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 come on. Because then we can... There we go. Now we can drop this DNA guy in here to teach genetics to that doctor and that will be perfect so then we can open this room up it's gonna have be fully upgraded that's gonna fit perfectly I'm happy with how that's turned out so what we cured 69 so we're getting getting there um, Yeah, we're yes, getting there with the amount of patients being cured. Our curate isn't great, but we'll get there eventually. A hostile value, it's not, it's not picking up. It's not picking up, but just, just leave us with it. We'll get there. We will get there. <laughs> Yeah, you can see all our air cons. It's a good job we have so many maintenance people. And as you can see, our, um, our GP offices are they're holding up quite nicely. I mean, not really any queues. Always, always a queue for here, though. Why? Alright, training course completed. So, we can now open this bad boy up. There we go. 
And let's see. Toilets need routine services. They can be. Do you know what? We've actually. We can actually do treatment for our um, DNA guy. So let's get treatment done. Treatment two, that, oh, uh, treatment one it's gonna be. And I f nearly forgot, I wanna turn diagnosis off this place. Don't need to be sending people here for diagnosis. We got that upgraded. So that's gonna be perfect. Let's stick the DNA guy in here. There we go. All right. I feel like it's looking good. Deluxe Clinic. That can be a next on our list. So what we've got, as always, let's do the counting. That uh, just in the DNA lab. You just in the DNA lab. So we have one, two, three, three treatment doctors. And at the moment. We have three treatment rooms, so we definitely need more treatment doctors before we start building here. For nurses wise, we have one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven treatment nurses. Wow. For one, two, three, four, five rooms. So I, we're pretty good for treatment nurses now. But could definitely do with some more treatment doctors. You're nearly done on that. Aircon needs maintenance. Yeah, don't want it. Definitely don't want it to become a fire hazard. That's for sure. Let's see how many people we need for treatment level two. Got just the two of them. So as you can see, it's it's just about now just controlling things making sure we're not expanding too big before we can handle it making sure we're still making money um yeah and just waiting 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 for those patients to come in just a bit of patience i feel this needs and constantly checking for your machines to be up um, repaired. Last thing you want is for a machine to be damaged. Then we have like an earthquake or something. Yeah. Will not be good. Let's whack our prices up. And it's one of the reasons why I have my prices up as well. Not only just to make the money, but just to dampen our reputation so we don't have floods of floods of people going through. Yeah, look at all this space we've got for training. Hospital earlier today. Something that might cause Especially me a this one. of excitement if only I knew who he was. And just what the devil is a perilous there we go. Go on. Anyway. Finish the training. Oh there we go. Training course completed. Beautiful. 130 is the quickest we're gonna get. Alright, let's do it. Could still do with another ward nurse. As I said, we could do with another treatment doctor. I've already, I've already forgotten how many we have. For on the way. Already forgotten. We have four. One, two, three, four, five rooms. But we're yet to build a deluxe clinic and a pans lab. Pretty sure the one of them's three by three. Yeah, there we go. That will fit nicely. We definitely do need a deluxe clinic. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. Let's just stick that here. Get the aircon unit just here. Wax and gold stars down. Of a smaller size room, so we just need to just make sure we're fitting these in. There we go. 
and we can get that upgraded nicely. I'm just going to move this just for a sec. And this, if I can, so let me pick it up. Come on, let me put it against the wall. There we go. Just want to move it just for a second, just so I can move that there. There we go. You can do the upgrade. And now I can move these to a, just a bit more sensible place. There we go. That will, that will work nicely. So now all we need to do is build a pans lab. So let's find a bit of a space here. Four by four. Big machine. Get it close to the door. Get a fire extinguisher in. That's always aircon unit. And whack out these gold stars. There we go. Level five. So could do with another treatment doctor. I ask and I'm provided. There we go. Two treatment doctors. Getting trained. I think that is going to do it for us in terms of staff. Five rooms, one, two, three, four, five doctors. Maybe one more. Uh, then it will be my last. <laughs> And look, we're at the 100 patients cured mark. Could definitely do with our cure rate going up. Could definitely do with our hospital value going up. We'll get that though. I see hospital value going up already. There's upgrading the Deluxe Clinic. Oh, it should be upgrading the Deluxe Clinic. Send them for treatment. That's fully upgraded. Fully upgraded. Fully upgraded. Just do a quick little check. See what needs. Repairing. Lots of machines here. All right, so we got that treatment doctors sorted. So let's get these two trained in. GP4, and that should really sort out like any need to send patients home. And I think we built everything we need now. Just the recovery room. Um, we haven't actually built one of those yet. So I think it's the only thing left that this hospital is going to give us. Ah, 7 out of 7 with night fever. Not bad. Uh, there we go. Yeah, this is this this is doing good. This is just going to be one of those. Um, oh man, look at them all go down so much. It's just going to be one of these levels now that we're just going to need to continually train. We're going to need to continually just make sure that nothing goes wrong. I don't think we need to push anything to make it go right. Just that nothing goes wrong. There we go. I thought it would be pretty quick. I said one more, didn't I? Yeah, I said one more, and that would be my last one. Did anyone want to? Let me... Yeah. There we go. That's my last one. I can actually finally get rid of that nurse as well. Yeah, we got three pharmacy nurses. You're going after this. I've been saying it throughout the whole game. This time I'm actually going to do it. How are we for... 
how are we for ward nurses? I'm fine with that, because uh, usually I wouldn't be, but the ward nurse has been pretty fine here. Ooh. Starting to get a few cues in our GP officers, so it may be time to get another one, two, three, four, five GPs, four rooms. Probably do with another GP. That pains me to get rid of them. I got rid of them just before I just hired them anyway. All right, let's see. Want those cure rates to go up. But also, let's see if we can get on top of like maintenance as well. So we got one, two, three, four, four janitors just doing maintenance. So let's let's get these trained up. I'm gonna just have an external person train them because I don't want to take another um, janitor out of action. Nurse required in injection room. Let's see how many awards we get. Da, 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 da. How many? Six. Again, unless we're going to get the no deaths, that's pretty much the best we're going to do. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with aiming for six. Let's do another round of maintaining. Yep. Janitor, to repair decryptor, please. Mm-hmm. I just put that order in. Cubism. So that is our recovery room. E Wait. Oh. Okay. Double check one more time. <laughs> Promise it's the last time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm okay with that. Let's get this done. Oh, huge room. Oh, well, I'm going to get away with doing it that way around. So I'm just going to, let's just bump this up to the edge there. And let's actually just move that a bit down just to make sure that the corridor is still good. Our recovery unit. So what's going to happen? The patient's going to come in. They're going to get cut up into it. They're going to go into that side down the left. They're going to get into little pieces. And they're going to be spat out here. It's a very, very interesting one to watch. It's pretty much the main reason why I said yes. So we haven't seen it before. It would just be good just to have a look. See what it's like. Let's get this. Oh, it's an extra gold star just for luck. I will get rid of that. There we go. Let's. Uh, I can't upgrade this as of yet. To be honest, I probably can if I build a research room and do the research, or go to Mitten University and do the research. Probably look into that. How is our. You upgrading that? Yeah, you are. Okay, good. I'll let you off. Training. Training's going pretty slow. Ah, well, what can I do to speed this up? Let's, let's get the rest of these down. Now you can see that the. Um, What's it called? The aircon unit's just having a bit of an impact on where we can and can't build extra bookcases. Oh, I've just trained you in maintenance in a room where you were too warm. So you didn't think about upgrading the maintenance, uh, doing the maintenance on the old um, aircon unit while you were there. Might have been a good idea. 
Uh, I, I want you to I want you to repair that machine. Maybe I'll call one. We've got someone coming for cubism. All right, here we go. It's going to be an exciting one. So look at that patient as well. That's pretty cool. So they come in here, they then get picked up. They get shaken around, and fall into little pieces. Oh, goes the head. And hopefully, they get molded into a new person successfully. Joggers Ripple. Ah, there we go, though. We got our first cure on that. Joggers Ripple. All right. I hate the Joggers Ripple one just because it's harder to, to see. And we got six people with it. Ooh, hella cues as well. Always our assistance. So, this can be... You can tell because they're usually stretching, they're usually doing some form of sporting activity, or they're running. So, but you need to be careful that they've not just got the um, energy bug. So you can see stretching... Mm, no, that wasn't it. See, if any of them start doing press-ups, um, sometimes they spin a basketball, sometimes they run like that, but you can see they've got the energy buzz, so it's probably not them. So that's the problem sometimes with having the trink machine. So you can see running, but didn't have it. So let's just see. Usually it's the itching that gives it away. There we go. Well, not itching, but just some form of stretching. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. Nurse needed in surgery. Just put that there. You're running around, but you're probably got an energy burst, yeah. But it's starting to get a few cues for our GP's office, so I think it's time we opened a new one. It's going to make for interesting cues, that's for sure. Janitor, please repair helixer. Yeah, you can see I'm not very good at this one. So. I'm just gonna just start curing people. You can actually quit the ep epidemics. Uh, I might do that for this one. But you know, you just see people running around. Sometimes they're stretching. Sometimes they're playing, doing press ups. Sometimes they're doing basketball. Sometimes they're doing silly things like that. But yeah, I'm gonna. I'm going to go ahead and quit it. Yeah, disease control. They can handle it. They're good at these sort of things. Alright, we have some more training to do. Because we need to get that cure rate up. The cure rate is 65%. It's not that good at all. Oh, and I'm pretty sure I said I can get rid of you now. Oof, seven years employee. Saza! Yeah, look, look at our hospital level. Pretty high. That's just because we've got pretty much every room done. In fact, we know we have got every room built that we can do. That's a, sorry, that is a treatment room anyway. I don't do the diagnosis room, so... And we've cured oh, nearly 150 patients. So hopefully we can start riding this wave a bit and just get a hostile value up. You can see it's not doing great. We've been spending a bit of cash. So let's just hopefully get it to pick up. 
some disturbing news Let's regarding an outbreak of disease in Two Point County. Down here. Let us hope the brave men and women Oy. in our local hospital can deal with the matter swiftly. If not, Come on. a our... helicopter can airlift me to a safe location. No, it took you 20 days to get from there to here. That took way too long. Oh, love, love the sound of people dying. That's being maintained. Let's just nip over here. Let's just flag these to get repaired. Yeah. I'm really glad we've got lots of maintenance people. That's that done. Really want to focus on training as much treatment as possible. Because I don't want to be hearing that sound continually. Da, 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 da. Not a good to hear sound. Ooh, that's a decent amount of money. God, why are we still having to not be able to fully diagnose people yet? Let's get our surgeon in there. ASAP Rocky. Too many people dying. You get that ghost. You get that ghosty. Ooh, didn't like our hospital. Oh well. You will the next time. Let's get that upgrade done. And let's hopefully get this training done pretty quickly and then we can move on with the next set of trainings. Hustle values jumped up quite a bit there. That's great. And I'm just going to get some of our staff just to get some more training done. There we go. Let's get them trained. Yeah, hustle value at 3.2, 3.166. It's not bad at all. It's just like our cure rate's not doing well at all. So we definitely need to sort that out. I mean, surgery's not a good one for... All of a sudden, we're just killing everyone. What's going on? Yeah, we need to address that. But we're nearly, tell, we're nearly at 200. We've done quite well to cure quite a lot of patients. Hopefully, we just give it a bit more time. We can, you know, get some of these nurses that are in the twos, get them in the threes. Like, these ones are only in the... Wanting to, yeah, get them all in the threes in terms of skill training, get them up. GPs were doing quite good, but our treatment doctors could definitely do with more. There's one treatment doctor who I haven't tagged correctly. Yeah, let's let's make sure we're getting that training in. They're all fine. Uh, we could definitely do with some more training for these. Let's get this done. Let's get you trained in Ghost Capture. Get that upgraded. And yeah, things... Oof. As... Yeah, as as it may seem opposite, things are going fine. Uh, I'm not I'm not concerned. We're making good money. Our hostile value is doing well. It's not as high as I'd like it to be, but it's getting there. Our cure it's terrible, but hopefully that's going to pick up. Um, yeah, I see picking up already. We're getting some good amount of training done. 
don't really care about thermal comfort for now. Let's train the psychiatrist. Yeah, 3.2 is not bad for the hospital value. These tagged. Quick little sweep. Supermarket sweep. And yeah, the, the only thing we're going to be able to do to get our cure rate up is just to get that, um, that get those trainings in. We get those trainings in, we make sure our queues aren't too big. Things are not like that. Let's just bump that on the side there. Yeah, I don't want our queues to be too big. In fact, let's just... Let's filter on here. Let's just send a couple of them home. Ones that we've not um, diagnosed yet. I visited a sick friend who was taking Yeah, we've got a, a bit of a lag in getting people diagnosed. Call me old fashioned, but patients are treated by doctors in hospitals, not have leaves. There we go. Look at all these we're waiting to get. Let's just send some of these home. Yeah, we've got lots of people that still need diagnosing. Get those GPs fully trained up as much as possible. Because having the diagnosis level high does really help. Oh. Cheers for letting us know. Does really help with the diagnosis, um, with the cure rate, sorry. Because if, say, you've only diagnosed them, say, like 60%, they've just not got a goodest chance of getting diag uh, of getting treated. Let's just replace some fire extinguishers. I've not done that for a while. I think I I've actually not done it all game. Let's just plop a few more down there. Oh, we should be all good around here. It's a fairly new building. few more over here. Let's just have a look over here. Need some machines to isn't covering our costs. So that's definitely not good for the hostel value. Yeah. Oof. Oof. 2.8. It's not done well there. few more. There we go. Alright. Let's see the next training. And we're going to sort this out. Yeah, you can see profit factor massively reduced there. We're going to sort it out though. We cured loads of patients. Just need to get that cure rate up. Yeah, see? Patients being cured everywhere. Yeah, some real damage machines. So you can you can hear all that ding ding ding. Everyone's getting cured. Not expecting as many awards there. I have just oh, received. I was wrong. Six. Our local and vulgarly named volcano has erupted once more, causing particular. Uh, I'm not going to accept the surgery one. Hospital. 
Surgery isn't a real good cure in general. And it's just a bit of a pain. Basically everything needs fixing. That's basically what I'm telling you. Another training done. Yes. Finally. Let's get more treatment training done. Alright. Well, I think I'm going to cut the video here. Um, we're going to make the next progress towards the third star. So we've got our 200 patients done. So we're going to work towards getting that hostile value up. So meaning making more money. Um, get our curate up at the same time. And we'll sort out the thermal comfort when we get to it. So thank you very much for watching. If you found this video useful, please give it a like. Let me know down in the comment section and subscribe to the channel. So you'll be notified when I push out the next video, which is going to be getting that last third and final star for this hospital. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next episode. Bye for now.